Welcome to the Amazon Rainforest. Today we are going to visit the people that have called the Amazon Rainforest home for a very long time. We will also get to know why this way of life may be coming to an end soon and what you can do to help save them. For these indigenous people, the rainforest can be a friendly place. There is always plenty to eat and also plenty to do. For these groups, the rainforest is school, farm, playground and church all rolled into one. They know which plants and animals are good to eat, which to use as medicines and which are poisonous. For you and I, Living in the rainforest would not be easy and would instead be very dangerous. Because the rainforest provides the indigenous people with all of life's essentials, they treat it with respect. The elders pass along their rainforest knowledge to the younger generations and a way of life is preserved. Sometimes, indigenous people wear their traditional feathered headdresses and colorful costumes for celebrations. They may also paint their bodies and wear jewelry made from feathers, shells, or beads. Left by itself, the rainforest is a stable environment. However, outsider involvement has now thrown it out of balance and worse. The largest threat to the Amazon in all rainforests is deforestation, cutting down the trees. Trees are being cut down at an alarming rate to make way for mining, farming, logging, and dams. Almost 20% of the Amazon rainforest has been destroyed so far. If this destruction continues, we may never find all the valuable medicine that the rainforest has to offer. Deforestation also destroys the habitat that many people, plants and animals rely on to live. Although many people are determined to keep as much of the rainforest as possible, little by little it continues to slip away. At the current rate, the rainforest could be wiped out in less than 50 years. This would be a tragedy for the rainforest people and the unique animals that live there. It would also be a global disaster for the world's climate. Another threat to the rainforest is that some animals, such as parrots and macaws, are being stolen away and sold as pets. If we hunt or trade in endangered animals, we only push them to extinction even faster. One of the most important things you can do is make your family aware that it's important to look for fair trade labels when possible. If farmers can earn a living and be paid fairly, they won't have to cut down the forest to sell its wood. It's also important to spread the word so that people don't buy products made from rainforest woods such as teak and mahogany. Don't buy any products made from endangered species like turtle shells. Don't support any pet stores that sell animals captured from the rainforest such as parrots. One of the most important reasons to save the rainforest is because so many medicines we need to survive are from there. Rainforests now have people pay money to keep the forests just as they are, so they can be visited. This is known as ecotourism. Visitors come to tropical rainforests to see the natural beauty of this habitat. They want to experience and learn about the exotic plants and animals that live there. They might even have an adventure or two. How would you like to visit a rainforest? We're all going to have to work together to save this valuable global resource. 
Sustainable use of the Amazon is the only way to save it. Isn't it great to know that there are things you can do to help the Amazon rainforest? Thanks for watching and listening.